Today, I want to share with you three things that you can start doing now that will help you get more done in your day. And stay around to the end because I have an interesting fact that you might not know. The first thing you want to start doing is waking up at least one hour earlier. And I know you may have a very busy schedule right now, but studies have proven that if you adopt a set sleep pattern, which means you go to sleep at the same time every night and you wake up at the same time every morning, even on the weekends when you're not going to work, you have a tendency to be more productive and have more energy. So the first thing you want to do is go to bed the same time every night at a decent time and set your alarm for an hour earlier because especially if you live with other people, this one hour window of quiet time with no distractions will allow you to get maximum focus. And you can do some very important things during this window that you've been putting off throughout your day. The second tip I have for you is to try one more time. Frustration leads to failure. Remember that. Frustration leads to failure. When you get to doing something, maybe it's going after a goal or some, starting something new and you get frustrated because you're not good at it yet or you don't understand every aspect of it or you're trying but it's not working. So you give up. When you give up and you stop, that's when you fail. You don't fail if you keep going. So if you can adopt the habit of when something doesn't go the way that you needed to go or wanted to go or expected it to go, you say, okay, I'm still going to try one more time. Then you're going to open the door to more opportunities that you've been closing the door to too soon simply because you were frustrated. The third tip I have for you is commit to accomplishing at least one task every day. So you have a goal, you have action tasks every day that you can do to reach that goal. Maybe you wanna be neater, you wanna have a cleaner house, maybe you want to save more money, maybe you want to start a business, write a book, get start a speaking career, get a new job. Maybe you just want to wake up and be joyful. If you can commit to doing one task, it doesn't matter how big or small it is, every single day you're developing the habit of consistency to the things that will help you get further in life. So if it's waking up, getting out of bed and making your bed, guess what? Adopting that habit of making your bed has you feeling accomplished already because you set in your mind a goal to do and you did it. Even though it was small, you did it. And then tomorrow you're gonna do it again. And now if you can just have a long list of days done right in a row, you're gonna be more productive. So here's my bonus fact for you. You have to adopt the 1% rule. And I'm not talking about 1% of the population does this and the other 99 doesn't. This is the 1% for you. If you can adopt the 1% habit in your life and realize that if I just do one thing, one thing right, if I give 1% more effort, if I give 1% more attention, if I give 1% more of myself, how much further can I be in the long run? I heard a quote the other day that says, small daily improvements equals long-term results. So if you're playing the long game, you got to start with your short game. What can you give 1% more of yourself to that's going to get you closer to your goals and give you a more productive day? But you know what it is. Before you go, I need you to comment below, come through if you're thankful that God woke you up this morning and stay tuned for more videos like this because she gone.